Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. In my color guide series, we'll be talking about the art of creating harmonious and amazing color combinations. We'll be moving away from the often quite limiting and old fashioned way of working with colorful outfits like dressing for your skin tone or finding your season. You see, I believe anyone can wear any color they love as long as the color brings out the best in you both physically and mentally. A good rule of thumb to follow is one, any color you have in your eyes is like Likely to suit you and two any color that brings life to your face instead of washing you out will work for you as well everyone has different perceptions of what colors are nice and what colors go together or not so play around with it and have fun this way of working with colors are at least to me much more liberating and easier to implement in real life don't forget to watch my how to find your style video after watching this one too so you can nail both your personal style and the colors you love once and for all build a lasting wardrobe that will bring you tons of joy and that you want to wear over and over again. In today's video I wanted to share with you four different ways you can wear and combine the color red. I personally love red. I find it to be quite a classic color and it's one of those few colors that I allow into my own quite neutral and minimal wardrobe every once in a while. Now we all pretty much know how to use any color like red as an accent color with more neutral outfits. So for example, implementing it as a red lipstick, a red nail polish, an accessory like a red bag, a pair of red shoes, or just using it as a piece of clothing combined with neutrals. But combining it with other colors can be quite amazing too. So that's what we're gonna be digging into today. Now, even though I believe that rules are meant to be broken, I am gonna be using a color wheel like this one today. This is a tool that I always use when working with colors because it's a very simple but effective way to find out which colors are most harmonious when paired. Together. So one thing to keep in mind when working with a color wheel like this one is that on one side of the color wheel we have all of the cool colors and then on the other side of the color wheel we have all of the warm colors. And a good rule of thumb is that the cool colors will pretty much always look nice together and the warm colors will pretty much always look nice together as well. But again, rules are meant to be broken. You might sometimes find a combination of a cool color combined with a warm color to look amazing as well. So play around with it, have fun. So with all that being said, let's have a look at four different ways you can combine and wear the color red. So first I wanted to share some examples of using red with the monochromatic color rule, which means that you take red as a primary color and then combine that with any tint, tone or shade of red in the same look. Depending on how many colors you choose to include in this outfit, this creates a lovely and fun and very harmonious kind of combination. So pairing a primary red, like a really rich red with anything from a super pale pink to a deep burgundy will always look nice, I think. And you know, both pale pink and burgundy are colors that both originates from red, so that's why it creates a lovely harmony. Again, you can of course wear head to toe colors if you are a really colorful person and if you love to play around with head to toe colorful outfits, or you can choose maybe two different colors and combine those with a more neutral look if you're anything like me and you like to keep colors on sort of like a limit in your wardrobe. So pairing again a primary red with a pale pink and then keeping the rest of the look neutral will most likely look very nice as well. Again, it kind of depends on how bold you want to look and what style preference you might have. In example number two, I wanted to dig into the analogous color rule. God, that's a hard word to say. <laughs> So this means that you pair red with any color closely located to red on the color wheel. In this case, I stuck with the warm side of the color wheel, so I decided to go for red combined with orange and yellow. A good rule of thumb when speaking the analogous color rule is to combine at least two different colors together, but no more than five to make sure that the outfit and the combination is still harmonious. I always think that pairing a more deep or rich color with more lighter and more pale colors work really well to create some contrast in a look. So I've decided to keep the jumper in a primary red color and then I chose to go for a more pale version 
of orange and the same with the yellow. So really tints of orange and yellow. I've kept the boots in a shade of orange, so a deeper, darker type of orange to again make sure that the look is very harmonious and looks nice paired together. So next up I wanted to share some inspiration on pairing red with its complementary color which is green. So we have the red here and then the color on the opposite side of red is green. Again, the complementary color. So I chose to let the red color again be bold and bright here because this video is all about the color red. And then I chose to go for a tint of green. Again, like I mentioned before, I always think it works really well when you keep one color more bright and bold and then go for one that is a bit more light on the other hand. In my opinion, this is a super wearable kind of outfit. Even though you've paired two colors together, I feel like for the minimal and quite simple me, I would still be able to wear something like this. Lastly, I wanted to share some inspiration on how to simply use the color red as an accent color. It's a super easy way to brighten up any neutral outfit and I would categorize this as sort of like the easy way out. If you're anything like me and you generally like more neutral outfits, then this could definitely be something to try out for you if you want to just add a pop of color to your outfits sometimes. Here you don't really have to think too much about which colors look harmonious together because really you can pair neutrals with any kind of accent color. So pairing black, white, gray, beige with any pop of color will most likely work every time. So there you have it guys, four different color rules and four different ways you can wear and combine the color red. I've linked some amazing Instagram profiles down below, which you can get inspired by in terms of dressing with color, as well as my Pinterest board with full of inspiration on how to dress with colors. So make sure you check that out in the description box. Also, before you leave, make sure you comment down below which color I should style up next time. Until then, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you very soon for another video. Bye guys. By supporting me on Patreon, it's possible for me to make high quality content in a continuous flow on all my platforms while making sure I stay educated and updated about sustainable fashion and lifestyle all the time and so I can pass on this knowledge to you guys. Thank you so much for supporting my work.